Good morning and welcome to another vlog. It's Tuesday today and Elisa and Issa are currently having breakfast while watching the iPad. It is nearly eight o'clock so they need to get a move on. I keep telling them, eat food, eat food, eat food. They don't listen. So iPad's gonna go off in a second. Issa is already ready because he leaked through his pajamas and his vest this morning, which was fun. Waking up to a wet baby is <laughs> something else really <laughs> but yeah he's already dressed so I gave him food that isn't gonna mess up his clothes as soon as he starts the day and Elisa is still in her pajamas she needs to get her uniform on it's five to eight right now but yes that's what's happening um, when I drop Elisa off to nursery I'm planning on going to Aldi because we have no fruit or like just bits and pieces like that which I need so that's what I'm gonna do also I'm gonna get some ingredients for my healthy sides video so I'm going to be doing that as well while Elisa is having her breakfast I'm going to be doing her hair because that takes a little while so I thought why not kill two birds with one stone so I'm gonna do that now Since Elisa has been ill, I got a recommendation to try these and I found them in Superdrug the other day so I thought I'd pick them up and Elisa has been having one a day. So I don't know if it's helped, <laughs> I don't know if it's going to help but it is worth trying if it makes her ill less. So yeah, these are great because they are one a day and they have no gelatin in them and they're really good. They just look like little gummy bears so Elisa loves them. You want to have one now? Yeah. Okay. Can I have three because I'm no. three? <laughs> she says, can I have three because I'm three? But of course no because it has, they're just vitamins, okay? They're not sweeties, they're vitamins. <laughs> Are you getting like a Hello? <laughs> These guys are fighting over this toy. Look, he's giving it to you, he's giving it to you. Ta, Lisa. Oh, okay, maybe not. <laughs> We're parked outside of Elisa's school. It is so dark still, oh my goodness. Elisa, are you ready to go to school? Lisa, are you ready to take Elisa to school? This boy doesn't let me stay for long with her. Every time I take her with, when I've got him, I stay until he starts acting really naughty or like trying to run away or just making a mess or whatever he does. I just leave when he starts being too much of a handful so that, you know, I still get to spend a little bit of time with Elisa at nursery, but obviously I can't stay for the whole time. Elisa understands that because I explained it to her. We are here really early. It's 19 minutes past. Normally this is the time that I'm leaving my house. <laughs> we have parked a little bit further away today so it's going to be a tiny bit of a walk. I'm going to put the buggy board on because I know that Elisa is going to moan about walking. <laughs> so I've driven all the way to Shirley because the other day it was really busy here so I was like you know I'm going to come back to this Aldi and I'm gonna do like a little shop with me type thing. I only need a few bits and pieces, not a full shop today, but yeah, I just thought I'd come back because it is massive in there. I don't know if you noticed in the vlog that I vlogged in there, but it's huge. So I'm gonna try and do a little shop with me. It depends on how this one does, but wish me luck.
Just finished the food shopping, it's all here. I'm gonna go home and do a little haul for you. Issa's watching Coco Melon in the back and hopefully that will shut him up. <laughs> that sounds horrible, but seriously. Um, I'm just gonna listen to the radio and go home. Just got home, taking our coats off. Issa is there just chilling. Guys, I really don't like this room anymore. Like, it's so dark. <laughs> it's, like, you can't really tell that much on camera, but it's so dark in here all the time. I've got the blinds open and it's still so dark in here. I don't really understand it, it's so annoying. But I shouldn't have painted it a dark colour really, but I really love that colour so I had to do it. Anyway, let's get into the grocery haul. Let me just set it all up because look at the state of my kitchen. I've got to clean it before I start this because I've got nowhere to put the food otherwise. Let's start this grocery haul right now. So let me find somewhere to put you so the lighting is better. This is perfect. I'm gonna put this here so I can put the bags on here. Let's get started. So, first bag. I'm 
I literally packed so quickly today because this woman had like speedy arms. So nothing is in like a specific bag. I tried to put things in like fruit and veg and frozen fridge stuff, bread, blah, blah, blah. But today that didn't happen. <laughs> the first, well, this is the last thing I got, but this is the first thing that's out of the bag. These are soft white sliced sandwich thins and these are so perfect for the kids lunch like they love them and I butter them a little bit and then put some cheese in there maybe like a chicken slice or whatever but they're so good Elisa loves them Issa loves them so easy lunch there. Next we have some bananas because we're all run out and then my kids have this sudden love for grapes so I got two boxes of the red grapes because we really like red grapes. And then I haven't got these for a while, but Issa was really fussy in the store and I didn't want to give him anything naughty. So I got these. These are strawberry and apple soft oaty bars. I picked up two pairs of these rubber gloves and these are just washing up gloves or like whatever you use them whenever you clean up anything gross. Like your bathroom yeah i needed a new pair for my bathroom and a new pair for my kitchen so i bought two of these i don't know where the other ones have gone right now and then also from the cleaning section i picked up a packet of 80 wipes this is like 79p or 85p or something i can't remember surface wipes these are just the fresh ones and then these were in the super six fruit and veg thing so i picked up some of these i don't know if my kids like plums 59p for five plums so all right and then at the till, I picked up three packets of these salty, sweet and salty popcorn and 120 calories per serving. Ooh, that's quite a lot, huh? I don't know. But I picked up some of those because the, they have like the small bags. Whereas if I got a big bag like popcorn, you just can't stop eating that, can you? So I thought I'd just get three small bags. So I've got three different snacks for each different evening. So popcorn and then we were baking yesterday and I didn't have any chocolate chips so I picked up some dark ones and milk ones. I was going to get some white ones as well but they didn't actually have any. And then we're running low on juice. I like to take these out with us when we go places so I picked up these. These are £1.50 I think for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight juices. Issa had one in the shop as you saw. And then I got some olive oil because we're running out. This is extra virgin olive oil. So we got that. I picked up some swing bin liners. These basically I use upstairs and whenever I'm like doing a clean, I just hang one of these on the door or I line my toilet bin with it or whatever. I just hang this on the door and then I just fill it up with just loads of rubbish. And they're not the best quality, but they were cheap, so why not? And then I picked up some peppers. This, these packs are really weird. They're mixed peppers and they're the everyday essential ones. They come with three red ones and then three massive green ones and all of them were basically the same. This one's kind of got orange on, that's why I got this one. <laughs> Just to be a little bit different, but I love red pepper so I got that. And then I picked up two packs of pears. These were in the Super 6 as well this week. Next I picked up some apples. I got some mini apples for the kids and then I got Braeburn apples for me because Braeburn apples are my favourite apples. And then I picked up some red onions because red onions are good to have on the side of things. My husband loves them. I put them in my salsas and stuff like that. And then I picked up two packs of coriander. These are the 35p ones and there's not much in there, but I could not be bothered to go to an Asian shop to get coriander. So I got two of those. The other gloves. I got some limes. Got some raspberries. I haven't had raspberries in ages, so I got some of those. I got some salad tomatoes. These are really good, they're like one pound I think for all of those and you get so many in there. I got some carrots, a little bag of carrots, popcorn. Got some baby plum tomatoes. These are really nice just on the side of any food. If you can't be bothered to make a fancy salad then just cut up some of these, a bit of cucumber and perfect. More coriander. Got some blueberries because Elisa loves snacking on blueberries. Elisa doesn't like blueberries. I like blueberries, let's try them. They're not crunchy, they're just soft. <laughs> and then I got some self-raising flour, just to top up all of my containers. Some plain flour, although I have a feeling that I already have plain flour in my cupboard. And then I got some caster sugar. And then the last thing that I got was some more flowers. These were supposed to be 4 dollars but they're 50% off because they're probably going out of date. 
but they look nice they look decent so them in a bit of water they'll be all right but look how pretty they are they're so gorgeous but that is everything i got i spent about 30 pounds i'm going to put all of this shopping away and then i don't know what i'm going to do after that you think is that pretty kind of like it gorgeous gorgeous I just love fresh flowers it just makes you feel so nice and special even though I bought for myself <laughs> what's my little guy do you want mommy Okay, time to be a mommy. Come on then. Oh, come on. Elise is having some lunch. She's having a cheese sandwich and some cucumber, grapes, and crisps. Is it good? Issa's having the same thing without grapes because he is not the biggest fan of grapes and he just mushes them into the carpet, which is what he did earlier. I need to clean that up still. <laughs> but I am going to have some egg in my sandwich, some scrambled egg. So I'm going to do that now and that is what I'm going to be eating. I'm calculating it at about 200, 250 calories for what I'm going to eat because these have... Uh, 99 calories in an egg has about 70 calories so that is an egg <laughs> and then i'm going to put some caramelized onion stuff on there as well so that's probably a few calories so less than 200 calories i hope maybe i'm gonna have a glass of orange juice because i can't have egg without orange juice just too no can't do it <laughs> Just gonna sit here and enjoy my orange juice and my sandwich and I'm also editing yesterday's vlog so that will be up very soon. Just a little bit later, the kids have had their lunch and I've edited a video. Elisa wants me to watch her jumping so we're just chilling in here. Mommy! Yeah? Look. Go on then. Whoa! Wow, that was very good. Okay. <laughs> oh my god, this rocking chair is broken, so it's literally lying down. It's like a bed. <laughs> also, I noticed this today. Look at this plant, my beautiful, beautiful plant, and it's gone all crispy. Can you see? Where is it? Mm, there, like it's gone all crispy there. I don't know why that is. Right now, I just want to sleep here. <laughs> I told Elisa to change out of her nursery clothes because somebody messaged me saying you should change her out of her clothes, like because obviously they like fest the germs and stuff. And Mom, make her wash her hands. Yes, babe. Look. Wow, it's so clever. Ooh. But. Yeah, we're just chilling. Um, their dad is back from work. He's gone to have a nap because he was, he's on morning shifts, which are really early. So he's just having a little nap while we just chill out downstairs. I'm probably gonna get some meat out to cook. I'm not sure what I'm cooking today. Yes, darling. Um, um, a dad that looks like a dog. 
to go over there because <gasps> it has to go over there. Okay. It's all over there, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I'm going to make the mango salsa today, which was one step closer to that video coming out. So stay tuned if you want that video. <laughs> but yeah, the mango salsa is going to be happening today because that is like, I basically went to Audi especially for like coriander and stuff. He pushed me into the lava. He pushed you into the lava? Yeah. What? Look at this piece of that and this can be a lot of cooks thinking they do it. Yeah. And these can be the lot of stuff. I've decided that we're going to do something a little bit fun, a little bit different, because these guys just hey. need a bit of fun. <laughs> so I've got some pa a paper roll that we used in the summer for painting in the garden. So I'm going to ba basically tape that to the floor and give them loads of crayons and pencils and whatever they want. And they can do some drawing on there. Turns out, must have finished the whole roll, so I'm gonna have to improvise and stick some paper to the floor. <laughs> this is what we've come up with. It's not the best, but it is enough for the kids to draw with. Here's some colours. Do some colouring! Woohoo! Lisa, do some colouring! Later, I've just uploaded yesterday's video. I'm not cooking today because my husband's cooking. Whoop whoop! This is what I've got so far: onions and chili, tomatoes, spices, pizza, peppers. While he's doing that, I'm going to do some cleaning in this room because there is food all over the floor. what my hubby has cooked. I'm gonna have it with rice and he's gonna have it with chips and it looks so delicious. Yum, yum, yum. I have just made this salsa which is going to be a recipe on my channel. Mm, it's so good. But I'm actually gonna end the vlog now because all I wanna do is take my scarf off and relax and be comfortable and eat my food in peace, get the kids to bed and that's it. <laughs> but thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought of the Audi thing and yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye